Hi, I'm Sophia Petro and I'm releasing a single called Rosé Glow on the 21st of July, um, which was written by me and Gabrielle Emery, my producer. So the writing process for Rosé Glow was, we were kind of in the studio, just working away at another song um, that I really wanted to feature on my upcoming EP, The 11th Hour. Turns out that we just couldn't make the song work. We tried, we just, it didn't fit, it didn't slot in with the rest of the songs. Um, so we kind of abandoned it and we were like, should we just write another song? Um, so we did. It kind of started like, Gabrielle put down a vibe and that very iconic guitar lick, which I've come to love at the start of the song, the da 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 da. We just, you know, pulled up the notes app and started writing the lyrics. We wrote till about like the end of the first chorus. So when I got home, I just finished off the lyrics. I'm pretty sure that like very night because I was so obsessed. The recording process was just as fun. There's actually a, a film camera sound in there that we wound up. Um, I remember this one time we went out for like brunch and burritos and we had some Aperol spritzes and then we got back to the, the studio and we were like, should we just randomly do final vocals? So we did. I'm, I was super obsessed with how they turned out because I didn't psych myself out, you know? I didn't plan for a final vocal day and I was very giddy, very happy. Um, and yeah, it was, it was a really fun process. The production is very, very pop. I feel like with the first two singles, they were, they were pop. I'm not saying they weren't pop, they were pop. Um, but like there were maybe some more organic elements to them. Um, but this is just a straight pop banger, which I love because I'm a pop girly through and through. Um, my favorite part is honestly, I think the chorus um, where that synth comes in, it's like, oh, your apprehension. It kind of goes out for a second and it goes <laughs> <laughs> I can't describe production. And the, and the sparkle, if you can hear it in the back. Like, <laughs> we did a lot of the Rosé Glow recording just at Gabrielle's home studio. Obviously when you, you know, record final vocals, you want there to be no sound. You want silence on the set. The quietest thing that we could find was her wardrobe. So yeah, the final vocals were recorded amongst her clothes and shoes. I was just in there, just like vibing around. What's the song about? I think Rosé Glow is about like, when I think of all the nights out with my friends, um, I think about how a lot of the time I had someone in the back of my mind who I was kind of into or like crushing on um, and we'd stumble upon them on a night out and I would never make my move. I would never say anything. And Rosé Glow is kind of like a bit of a fantasy to me. The reality of what happened and then it's like the possibility of what could have been. And so, yeah, sometimes like, do you like someone or are you just drunk? It's <laughs> a big I question. Love, I do, I like <laughs> Did I drink too much rosé? You know, you might be just like dazzled by the glow of the rosé. Yeah. Um, but in reality, they just, they're not that great. Good. You know? Why is this song special to you? Um, I love this song because it's honestly like my first collaboration. I wrote like all my songs by myself in my room. And I mean, I love doing that, but Writing with Emery was, it was so fun and I just never experienced anything quite like it. Just great friends and it was a really fun process and keen to do more of it um, in the future. So there's that, take that as you will, but yeah. yeah. And is there anything exciting coming up that we should look out for from Sophia Petro? There is, so this song. Or is it always a bit of a prelude to my debut EP, The 11th Hour, which is coming out in August, um, which is very exciting. There are some more, you know, profound deep moments on there. But Rosé Glow is just like, you'd put it on with your friends while you're getting ready. You'd like be dancing around. It's just really fun. It's a really fun song. Yeah, <laughs> Make sure to give me a follow on social medias, um, at Sophia Petro on everything. Um, the song is out the 21st of July um, and there are many exciting announcements. So I would just, for your own sake, stay up to date. I hope you like it. There's lipstick in the carpet, pray this apartment, maybe I'll forget it.